Hi, welcome to Gayatri's Cook Spot. I am Gayatri Kumar and today I'll be showing you how to make white chocolate ganache. This ganache is used for frosting the cake. The consistency highly depends upon the proportion of cream and chocolate we use. For the recipe link, please see the description box below. Make sure that the chocolate bar is at room temperature. Slice it into tiny pieces. And transfer them to a bowl. For this I will be using low fat cream. And I will be coloring the ganache this time. To color the ganache, I am using gel color. It's easy to mix with the cream. Mix it evenly and then gently heat the cream. You don't have to boil it. When the cream starts bubbling, pour it on the chopped white chocolate. The chocolate will be more than the cream, so it takes a while to melt the chocolate. Mix it well. We'll be using a double boiler to finish off the ganache. Heat water in a pan and place the bowl on the pan. Make sure that the bowl does not touch the water. Only the steam will heat the bowl and in turn it will melt the chocolate. White chocolate is very sensitive to heat. So, we will be melting it on very very mild heat. If you feel that the bowl is hot, just remove it from the double boiler and let the residual heat from the bowl melt the chocolate. The chocolate has started melting. So, I have taken it off the heat. You can repeat it again and again until you get a lump free ganache. The consistency of the ganache must be like this. I have transferred it into a different bowl. This is to set the ganache. Just cover it with a cling wrap and set it for 2 to 3 hours. And then you can easily frost your cake with it. This is the frosted cake. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you. Please subscribe to my channel.